It's a two-day task all about lending a hand. That's heavier than it looks. <laughs> to help each other and help high school students okay, build so a foundation of learning. It's been great to see what we started with, which this was just a huge open area that wasn't very useful to their students. More than 300 volunteers from Fidelity teamed up with Dater High to transform the school over the next two days. Among other projects, they'll be working on building an outside classroom in the no, school's no, vacant no, garden space. With this classroom, the teachers will be able to bring their children out here um, and then not just talk to them about the sciences, but let them get their hands in the dirt. This is all a continuation of this. These are garden beds that the same group planted last year as a way to promote interactive learning and get the kids outdoors. Inside, they're creating a mural for the gym and an accessible testing space for students. Volunteers say adding resources and beautifying the school can improve test scores and overall learning. To create an environment where when the kids come back to school in August, they walk in and they say, oh my gosh, someone really cares about me. Someone is invested in my success and someone's worked really hard to create an environment in which I will thrive. Two days to set the framework for a brighter generation of students. In Western Hills, Megan Mitchell, WLWT. News 5.